Let's turn to the weather. A historic May storm is bringing snow and record cold temperatures to the Great Lakes. Meteorologist Gerard Bailey is tracking the forecast. Gerard, it's May. We've all had enough of this. I know. Justin Timberlake usually promises something better than this, okay? When he says it's going to be May, I'm expecting sunshine. I'm expecting warmer temperatures. We have been stuck in this pattern, and it has not been fun, depending on where you are in the country. Rain, cold, dreary, off to the northeast, sort of the same situation out to the west. Right in the middle, it's been dry. So what the heck is going on? Why is it being like this? And why will it just not go away? Well, we're stuck. We're stuck in what's called an omega block. All right, just the sound of it, block, means that we have a blockage going on in the weather pattern. Nothing moves when we have this in the upper levels. It's in the shape of the omega when we have that, and that's the jet stream. So once it breaks down, and it will, but it's going to take a couple of days, then we'll finally start to see the weather moving, getting out of here. Some changes will finally happen. Some of them will be very good changes, especially for us here, Mitch. And one of those will be a big change in temperatures. But first, let's just show you what today is going to look like. Still kind of cold, kind of dreary, but that's just today. Going forward, we'll start to see the changes where, where it's been so dry across the central United States, we're going to see thunderstorm chances return. Uh, across the west, eventually it'll dry out. The northeast will eventually start to dry out. And more importantly, it's going to really warm up, finally. The colder than average air is going to move out. We're going to be seeing temperatures recovering very nicely as we move later into the weekend. And lasting even further, six to ten day outlook looking so much better. Mitch, I'm finally going to put some tomato plants in the ground starting today. I, I, I'm confident enough that I think at least sub freezing temperatures are gone. Hey, there's going to be plenty of rain, so yep. uh, they'll have good soil. Thank you, Gerard. Thanks for watching. Go to newsnationnow.com to find NewsNation in your cable lineup. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of NewsNation's fact based, unbiased coverage.